Hello students, welcome to my channel. I am Seema Saini and I hope you all are good. Today we are starting with the writing series and its first topic is advertisement. So let's start. First of all we will understand what is advertisement. An advertisement is a message carried in one of the various forms of media such as newspapers, magazines, radio, television and the poster. The purpose of most advertisement is to persuade a particular audience or a group. Now remember these steps. There should be no unnecessary words in the advertisement. It should be simple and to the point. It should be worded beautifully and tastefully. The name of the advertiser and of the advertiser product should be given in bold capital letters. A business advertisement should never be lengthy. It should be a, as brief as possible. Now let's understand what is the format of advertisement. Okay. So first step is make a rectangular box like this on your screen. First of all, draw three lines. Don't draw the last line, draw side lines and upper line. Okay, so last line we will draw after completing our content, after completing our advertisement. Okay, so first of all, first step is make a rectangular box, but remember, draw only three lines, and last line we will draw after completion of advertisement. Now we will understand how we will make our advertisement okay so first of all a rectangular box okay and then heading at the top middle okay at the top middle there should be heading and heading should be in capital letters all letters should be capital okay and after that you will give introduction of the product and after that you will tell the qualities and after that you will uh, tell the contact okay let's take one question first I will read question because read the question first properly because its content should be in the uh, advertisement okay uh, don't write out of your mind your Content should be related to the question. Okay, you need. I'm writing. I'm reading the question. You need a stenographer for your office. Write a brief and to the point advertisement for the situation vacant column of a local newspaper. Okay, so this is the question. Means you need a stenographer for your office. Okay, so how will you read? How will you write it? First of all, make a rectangular box. Okay. So then top middle you will write heading like this situation vacant okay situation vacant write the heading in capital letter capital letters okay situation vacant this is the column of newspaper okay don't write the newspaper name you will write the column of the newspaper and column of the newspaper is situation vacant okay and after that we will write content First of all, we will give introduction, okay, what you want, like in question, you need a stenographer for your office, means you need a stenographer for your office. So how will you read, how will you write it, wanted an experienced stenographer for our daily office, okay, and after that, we will tell about that what type of qualities, what type of qualifications should be there, okay, and you will write candidate must be graduate who can handle office correspondence independently then you will tell about the salary what will be the salary there okay then you will write salary according to qualification and experience then you will write how many days will be there to apply then you will write there apply within seven days the post box number 15020 delhi 110006 okay this is the address but remember, address 
should be mentioned if address is mentioned in the um, question paper then write that address okay don't write address out of your mind if there is no address mentioned in the question then write out of your mind ah, okay let's take second second question this is it's different kind of question you plan to sell your maruti 800 draft a suitable advertisement in not more than 50 words to be inserted in a reputed daily giving all necessary details of car you are pihu pratap of 12 ramnagar colony palampur okay so here is the dis, uh, description of address here you are pihu pratap of 12 ramnagar colony palampur but remember don't write the both name pihu slash pratap don't write the both name okay you will write either pihu either pratap okay write only one name there so this address this advertisement is about you are selling maruti 800 okay so let's start how you will do it so first of all you will make rectangular box okay but remember draw only top line and side to lines okay don't close the uh, don't close the last line you will close this line after completing the advertisement okay so first of all at the top middle you will write heading okay heading what will be the heading beside after reading the question you plan to sell your maruti 800 okay means you want to sell the maruti 800 so you will write heading like car for sale okay car for sale okay and look at this heading this heading should be like this in capital letters okay all letters should be capital there okay and after that when you will write the content so first of all you will give introduction okay introduction of the product like a 2000 model white maruti 800 okay done 7000 km accident free fully insured and in very good running condition is offered for sale okay you will tell each and everything that uh, what is the state of your car okay model um, okay done 7000 km accident free fully insured okay like this and after that you will give the reason why you want to sell this okay so then you will write the owner is going abroad and must sell the car in a couple of days okay and after that you will write interested you will call the interested parties like this interested parties with reasonable offer may please contact pratap at 12 ramnagar colony palampur mobile 9814127346 okay so if you are writing the mobile number remember this number the digit should be 10 okay now next example you want to let out a portion of your house okay you want to let out a portion of your house draft a suitable advertisement giving details to be published in the local daily in its to let column giving your address as anil sud 47a dholadhar colony palampur okay remember you will write address which will be mentioned in the question okay otherwise your marks can be cut there okay so don't write address out of your mind if there will be no address in the question then you can make your own address okay but if there is address in the question don't make it yourself okay so write that address which will be mentioned in the question okay so what is question you want to let out a portion of your house okay so look at here this is column to let okay so we will give heading to let so first of all make a rectangular box okay so after making rectangular box rectangular box you will write heading and heading should be at the top middle 
and your heading should be in capital letters like this okay and after writing this you will give introduction of your house okay the first floor of a newly built spacious house in dholadhar colony palampur is available on rent it is a three room set with attached toilet for each room provision for car parking also exist beautiful lawn in the first in the front and also in the rear of the house okay here after then you will tell the expected rent okay so what is the expected rent you will write there expected rent rupees 11000 per month okay then you will write that address like the right contact and write the that address which is mentioned in the questionnaire anil sud 47 e dholadhar colony palampur okay then write in this contact anil sud 47a dholadhar colony between 6 pm and 9 pm any day of the week okay so now next you propose to sell your flat okay as you are going abroad draft an advertisement for it to be published in the times of india okay under classified column but remember don't write the newspaper name okay so for this uh, i decide what heading will be here okay uh, read first line again of the question you, you propose to sell your flat okay means you want to sell your house okay your flat so what will be the heading flat for sale okay so first make rectangular box okay make three line draw three line side line and top line and don't lie don't draw the last line okay you will uh, close this line after closing your advertisement okay so write heading at the top middle and all character of that heading should be in capital letters okay so first of all you will give introduction of the house okay how will you give the introduction a beautifully furnished flat on the ground floor having two bedrooms a kitchen a dining room a sitting room lobby space and space for car parking is available for sale in in the civil line area of the town the after then you will tell what is the purpose to sell uh, why you are selling this uh, uh, house okay then you will write the the owner is going abroad shortly okay then you will call the interested parties okay then you will uh, write the interested parties are requested to contact phone number 0161230 or mobile 9814127346 okay you can write landline or mobile number but remember mobile number write the uh, 10 digit number okay so i hope it's clear to you now last example you want to start a computer showroom draft an advertisement seeking a suitable building on rent your advertisement is to be published in the wanted on rent column of a newspaper okay wanted on rent column okay if there is name of column then you will write in heading column name okay so here is name of column wanted on rent then you will give heading wanted on rent okay so let's start in this question you wanted to start you want to start computer showroom okay so what's the requirement for this you will write so first of all you will give the introduction so first make rectangular box okay and at the top middle you will write heading like this wanted on rent but all character should be in capital letters like this okay then after that you will give introduction wanted on rent suitable premises for setting up computer showroom okay our minimum requirement then you will tell about what's your requirement our minimum requirement is one large hall three attached or adjoining rooms okay and after then 
you will call interested owners okay interested owners may please contact phone 8700024 simla okay so i hope you all understood that's all for today see you soon in my next video till then bye